not to say that it's not continuable, but sometimes you have to reset on day one for a more optimal start. I could have easily like killed everything and got a couple pellets, blah blah blah, but it's faster to just reset and have a proper one. Uh, kill Olimar, or have a Pikmin Extinction, same thing. You can even, I think, just go to Sunset if you want. All of them are valid, but uh, it's hard to say, because Day 1 actually has a few extra things that you can kill. Um, day 2, the only reason you would do Day 2 is because of the Nectar Patch. But if you can, in an ideal world, get a Honey Wisp or, um, or a Flint Beetle on Day 1 at an ideal time, then Day 1 is much faster. Overall, I think it's about the same. And also, you have to get lucky. So, it's hard to say. At the moment, I don't know is the real answer, but I think it's about the same. Uh, and I would rather just do day one for the chance of getting the best option. If you see what I mean? Like, I tend to go for the best option, even if I don't get the best option. It won't be too bad. And the best option is, of course, when you get uh, Nectar on day one. So, I like your thinking, but um, unfortunately, I don't think Day 1 Extinction or otherwise uh, really helps the situation. Bam, bomb. Another water dumple. That's not a good start, actually, unless it drops two water dumples. Uh, unless it drops a one pellet. Kind of sucks. Okay. Drops a red pellet, that's fine. Go with that. Ah, too many dumples. Dumples are definitely the worst enemy in Rando uh, to run into, because they actually need, like, a non-trivial number of Pikmin to kill. Uh, sorry, I don't. Um, but literally, just type in Pikmin Randomizer into YouTube, and the guy who made it is called Minty Mio. It, it's literally that easy. Uh, sorry, I, I don't have a, a link right now. Super easy to find, though. Ooh, that's a good five for the dumple here. That's actually pretty good. So, actually, Pikmin Randomizer has a little bit of competition now, because um, Dodog, or Doodog, who's been playing Pikmin 1 and learning it uh, as a speedrun overall, or a vanilla speedrun, he's also now going for sub-130 rando. So that's pretty funny. Maybe we can have a, a world record um, back and forth. Thank <laughs> you. 
Pop stew. Yeah, over here. It's not nothing. It's nothing new. I just haven't been playing Pikmin lately. It's the new version, but it's it's not new. It's not to say that it's a new version. That's what I meant. That's what I meant. If I said new. Oh, nectar. Yes, let's go. More, more. Don't waste it. Nice. Okay, that's good. I think I'll just flower up and go there right now. <laughs> Big money. That was a good find right at the end. Flynn Beal. Go. Hey, super quick. I have a very healthy number of Pikmin right now. Shout outs to the best emote on the face of this goddamn earth. Fucking impact site. Dude, that rocketed into the ship. Could have been much quicker though. Sorry, and Nubtub. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, it's it's emu only. It crashes on console, unfortunately. Impact shade. As in the shittest emote on Twitch. <laughs> oh, it's such a bad meme. It doesn't it's not even funny. It's only funny, ironically. But oh god, it's it's an awful joke. Just the impact site uh, emote in general is just a terrible, terrible meme. But I've forced it into existence. So it's my own fault, I suppose. Anyway, I'm hoping to stream a lot more uh, these days because I'm pretty much done with an old hobby. That I, like, my COVID hobby was making buttons and stuff, and I'm done with that. I'm actually selling all my stuff and moving on, like, cleanly away from it, so. Curtis, I haven't streamed since Lens Please was even a thing. Uh, I'll have a look at Frank Facey. I always uh, like to keep on top of it, actually. But yeah, as far as I knew, Lens Please wasn't even a thing. I've been dead to the world for so long. Smoky Brogs. Well, it could be the good one. It could be the, you know, the one with the part. Let's hope so. Because that would save a lot of time. Please have a part. Da, 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 da. Oh.
Oh my god, yes, let's go. Not everyone failed that. Tasty lag. Yeah, the growth phase is basically nothing. Uh, I'll kill this stuff now. Secret safe over there. That sucks a little. Maybe I should have targeted it. What's here? Ball blacks! No thanks. Okay, so we're splitting up. See, you know, ball blacks aren't actually that hard to deal with. But the issue is, it takes a lot of time. That's number one. And also number two, there's no guarantee that I'll have the setup correct. Because seeing it in anywhere except its like final arena, it's actually a little bit of a challenge. Also, hello, pellets. Nice to see you again. Yeah, I'll kill this thing. Oh, I just, I forgot to put away yellows, uh, reds, I mean. I'm fine that the yellow came with me. I didn't mean it to, but we'll, yeah, figure something out. There's literally nothing else to do while I wait. I just realized that there was exactly one other thing to do. <laughs> oh man, this game is tough. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, it's, it's yeah. That specific one is next to other bosses, which I never even mentioned, but of course uh, I meant to. Okay, guys. Oh god. Let's get out of here. Tell you what, destroying that gate might not even be a bad idea. I think best is to just come this way and get this.
Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Yes, Arcane. What's up? What do you want? Don't look at me like that. If you think that's bad... By the time I had tea with Muhammad Ali. I mean, the Prophet Muhammad. Damn it, I messed up the joke. No. Did I blaspheme? I'm sorry. I blame it on God. Stupid God. Ugh. The seed is straight fire. Uh, there are more bombs in the thing. Oh, good. Put the yellows over there. Very helpful. All blacks. Double, double. Wait, I just remember that you can you can do this without having to kill the Bobblex. I'll be fine. Ah, sweet relief. The third part I get will make my butt feel nice or something. Also, that was actually really close. <laughs> not small. It literally is not small. Oh. 
Right, so first things first, I'm going to clear the area with my reds. Then I'm going to bomb the gate, because it always goes badly the other way around. That said, though, I could have actually done it this time, and it would have been fine. Getting a lot of light treasures right now. Yeah, you rupture my ears. Yeah. Yeah, because I was zoomed out, that's probably why. Oh no! Pick it up! I don't think I even got everything. Uh, there are three parts left, and they are the UV lamp. Sorry, I'll just say where they would normally, what they would normally be: the shock absorber, the Geiger counter, and uh, the Sagittarius. And I know for a fact that Sagittarius is the secret safe, and uh, the UV lamp is where the shock absorber would normally be. I didn't find out what the Snagret has. If I was to kill the Snagret, I don't know what it has. Um, however, I do know that it was the Ball Blacks this time, which is why I didn't kill it. So, anyway, um, that means that when I come to Forest of Hope on the second trip, it'll be super quick. It'll be so, like, in and out. <sighs> Especially if it's an easy boss fight. Or a moving boss fight, even. And I left three reds on the bridge, but that's fine. Alright, so that's actually a pretty good day. I got 41 uh, yellow. Which is a good thing, you know? So I think the strat is now withdraw max... Uh, max yellow. Minimum red. Just yellows have more uses in Forest Naval than reds do, even though there's sometimes fire. So it really depends on if there's a fire geyser. Chronos reactor in the water. Is that a prog? Yes, it is. It's a prog boss fight also. Thank you, Grass. God, Grass has been nice to me lately. Um, do I want to deal with that smoky prog? The answer is actually I don't, I don't know. Maybe not, and I'll just save my bombs for um, my second trip here. Tell you what, so cunning rotors are up here. God, it was so far away. You still blew me. 
You know what? Blow me. Literally. <gasps> Blue candy pop! Yes! Okay, actually, amazing. Also, this snitch bug might be the, uh, the boss. Unsure of that. Oh my god, yes! Thank you. So I'm going to do very well on blues, I think. Should I just start growing blues now, is the question. And I think the answer is... Suck my entire pee, -pee. radar yet, but this could be the boss. No, it's a puzzle. I don't care. I'll take it. Okay. Glue on drive in the water. Well, I mean, 50 is 50, right? God, I worked this out perfectly. And a, and a freaking nectar as well. And a 20 pellet! Yo, let's go! I didn't even know that was a thing, but apparently if you fully finish the candy pop, you get a, a good pellet out of it. I, uh, I wasn't aware of that. That did take a long time, but it's still 50 fucking blues. I mean, yes. Thank you. Alright, I'm gonna grow up. I'm gonna grow up. Yeah, yeah, you could say that. Let's go. Let's go. This is so awesome. Freaking blue candy pop. Save the day. Oh shit, I haven't got the blue onion yet. <laughs> They're confused. <laughs> use the prog to grow. Uh, I could have used the prog, but instead I used the candy pop. Okay. Here we go. Time for my first blue Pikmin. Let's go! That's so good. I'm just gonna find out what's on the Libra Island. Radiation canopy in the water. Uh, is that a Mega Stabilizer? No, I think that's Analog Computer. Damn it! I don't have the perfect angle. I think it's Analog Computer. Oh. 
So basically, blue candy pop OP. Chronos Reactor in the water, I knew that already, actually. Don't need to get this fully collected. If they die, they die. sucks that that geyser gives you, like, a, a glimpse of the bottom, but unless you know your part anatomy, like, insanely well, it's actually kind of hard to tell what the thing is. Alright, anyway. Let's move on, shall we? So, the gate that I'm first breaking with these bombs here is this one. Right, glue and drive, I remember now. I'll let it out, but not kill it. Or maybe I'll kill it, I don't know. I think I'll deal with this section the other day. The next day, I mean. Wait, stop! You're going the wrong way. That's an annoying cutscene. Should be fine.
Um, it's not sometimes. It's every time you throw a, a, a whistle, uh, throw a yellow. When you throw a yellow, they drop their bomb. But if you dismiss a yellow, when you whistle them, they don't drop their bomb. It's different states of idleness. And yes, it's different on me. <laughs> you cock monsters. Look, they just killed two Pikmin. I still don't have radar. Ah. That's annoying. I need to keep these guys loaded, otherwise there'll be problems. They are literally the most annoying enemy. They couldn't be more annoying. Look at this. Alright, I want to get the thing down. Whatever's up here, I want to get it down. I might be able to. Oh. A random blue. Right. What's up here? Yes, it was analog computer. I was right. I can get it down and then get it slightly collected and then we're good. And then I don't even need yellows at all for the next visit here. God, this has been so much more productive than some of my previous ones. Coming up there. Now, the reason I moved the analog computer a little bit more is because I just realized, just then, if there's uh, a bug that destroys bridges um, on the next day that I come here, then it will start attacking the bridge. So best is actually to move the analog computer off the bridge. Unfortunately, I didn't have time for that, but I at least moved it a couple of steps. So it should be safe overall. And if, the, if it starts destroying the bridge, actually that's fine, because the analog computer will get unraveled slowly and pushed by the end of the bridge, up the bridge. So, the reason I moved the analog computer up there. Uh, it was just a bit of um, big brain time. So now it looks like I'm plus a lot of time, but no, no, no. I'm so far ahead right now. I am so far ahead. Wait. Uh, turn, turn off, you cock. I am so, so far ahead. Jesus Christ. Right, and now if I get snitch bug, please give me snitch bug. Uh, I can't tell what it is. Uh, I would love snitch bug right now. Wait, the same one? Or you mean... Wait, Jakester, where are you from? Because it says Manchester on it. I mean, if you're from Manchester, then sure. I believe you. That was actually a really annoying time for that guy to attack. No bother. Right, okay, well, the hard rock shirt on its own is not an uncommon thing. 
Right, that's enough time wasted. Let's go. Uh, it's just a Wally Wog. Actually, wasn't my intention to kill those yellows, but I did. Whoopsie. Hey, yellow candy pop. This is one of the times when I would consider even using it. Thanks for the. Hey, you know what? That's one of the biggest compliments to me that you can possibly give. Saying that you like my memes. Legitimately, that fills me with joy, so thank you. <laughs> right, they, they should be safe. didn't know they had Hard Rock in the UK. It's like a global thing. Hey, nice tits, dude. No. Nice memes, bro. I wouldn't mind if someone said I had nice tits. Because at least they're nice. I mean, the fact that I have tits is irrelevant. If they're nice, they're nice. I wouldn't mind someone to say, you have nice tits. However, if someone says, you have nice memes. Nice cock. <laughs> Thanks, man. So I chose Forest Naval, sorry, Forest of Hope, because I thought this might give me the best chance for the area cutscene skip. <sighs> nice shirt. You haven't even seen any of my good shirts. Right, anyway, I know the plan today. Very easy, simple stuff. Some blues, and maybe some reds to help the boss, depending on what it is. First we deal with the bridges. No fire guys, it's that's good. Man's about to get an unbeatable freaking. I knew that would happen. Ah oh, fuck, it's still happening. I'm about to get an unbeatable. <laughs> Uh, randomizer time. Yeah, I'd appreciate it if you weren't there. That'd be nice. Alright, I can't tell what it is. So it's either Gulix or BLL or Snagger. Yellow candy pop, as if I needed it. Wait. Yeah, don't do that.
just gonna assume it's a Gulix. <laughs> no! I pressed the X button! I slipped. <laughs> That's not the button that, that kills the enemy. <laughs> That's okay. Oh no, glow and drive. That's actually a bad time for the glow and drive. Thank God I still have 51. Oh my God. Right. Let me just check if there's anything that's going to eat these guys. No. Oh my God, this is going well. Random Snagrit just chilling. All right. Well, with these 14, I guess I can get the UV lamp. <laughs> oh wow, this is actually pretty good. This is good rooting. I didn't intend this, by the way. But this is good rooting for the UV lamp now. Oh yeah, Pikmin 1 BLL is so much cooler. It's a hard enemy. It's freaking difficult. And it's quite tricky. Three reasons right there. No, but seriously, it actually looks like a cool enemy. Pikmin 1. It's just the sense of terror you get from Pikmin 1 BLL is unrivaled. Compared to Pikmin 2, Jesus Christ. No, it's nothing. Ah, whatever. You can have one, bro. I'm giving you one. Pikmin 1 BLL is much harder. You don't have purples. It has like twice the health. Um, the stomping cups actually can kill Pikmin, as opposed to Pikmin 2, which they literally can't. Loads of reasons, bro. Actually, I should have just done that. I should have let it get collected. Whatever. Secret safe is max carryable, though. Getting a little bit of lag. The occasional lag switch is active. Oh, dwarfs are so hard in this game. Right, so I can get the area cutscene skip now. With the UV lamp and the secret safe, of all things. How nuts is that? Super nuts, I'll tell you that. Ah. Oh shit. Uh, I wasn't ready. Hey. Let's go, that was still faster. Da 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 Bit of lag, but that's okay. Yeah. That was all three. I was just making sure in my head that that was everything. Oh my god, I'm gonna be so far ahead after this. Forest Naval. Oh my god. What's left? Right, okay, I think about Forest Naval. So, the two bosses over there, and also the mini boss. That's three. Uh, I need to get the two things near the bridge. That's five. And that's everything, right? I got the stuff out of the water. There's radiation canopy. It's, it's just chilling. I need to collect that. Uh, I got everything else. Wow. I'm going to be like... I want to say like six minutes ahead. Wait, that's wrong. No, not 16. So seven parts still to collect. There's those. Two. Five. Six. I'm missing one. I don't know what it is, actually. Uh, I'm sure I'll figure it out. Ah! 
No! <laughs> That's cruel. Don't do that. Wait, I don't need to do that. Ah. Funny place for a puff store. Come back for that. Man's unstoppable. I think it's Gulix. Have a feeling, you know. Did I kill it already? I don't think so, right? Yeah, I didn't kill this last time. Well, did I? It was the Gulex last time, right? Actually, yeah, it was the Gulix already. Damn it, I'm dumb. Anyway, so Smokey Prog to kill. He's just chilling. Or is he coming? Uh, I'll kill it with bombs. Oh no! This was the. This is. The, this must be the treasure. This must be the mushroom guy. Ha! Huh. Okay, I'm confused. But it must be something that moves. And the only thing that does that is the uh, snitch bugs. So that must be what it is. It must just be a snitch bug running around somewhere. I kind of need the radar. Deja vu. Just been in this place before. Just kidding. Ah, I could have used it on that black gate, but that doesn't actually do anything, I just realized. Oh, uh, okay, what's left? I don't know where that other enemy is, but it must have just been somewhere else. I don't know what to do with these bombs, actually, either. Oh my god, these guys. I, th I thought they destroyed this gate much quicker than this. Your mum woke up. <laughs> Good. I actually don't need more blue. I may regret saying that, but I'm going to give that to yellow. Problem now is, if it's a roaming enemy, I don't have radar. 
and I don't know where it is. Ah, they'll be alright. Just don't look. So I must have gotten the Gulix treasure already and just forgotten about it. But I keep saying that it was a Gulix because I thought it was a Gulix. Ah, I don't know. No, that was the last run. I don't remember. <laughs> What's the problem? Like, the dementia kicks in. Yeah. I'll use the analog computer to push the other one out of the fire. So actually, I only have to dodge the fire once. That's with this. Perfect. Oh. It doesn't come back. You know that, right? I'm fairly sure it doesn't come back. The, the run's dead. This was so fucking fast. Oh my god. Shit. Well, it's over. I have to reset. It might respawn. That's what I was thinking. I might just come back, uh, come back here again, and hope that it respawns. Yeah, today it's gone. Also, I'm not sure where the other parts are in this area. I'm supposed to have 19 right now, right? So I'm missing one. Where is it? I thought it was the mushroom guy. I haven't, I haven't done the mushroom yet. Like uh, the, the puff stool thing. But it might have just been a snaggerit, but if it, uh, not snaggerit, snitch bug. If it was a snitch bug, I killed the snitch bug already. So where is it? And I don't have the radar, so I can't find it. It's pretty rip. But I'm going to go to sunset anyway. I might still be massively ahead. If I can collect this, if I can collect the Coronis Reactor, I'll still be massively ahead. And hopefully just the both, both missing treasures just come back now. The game, not so fast. Pretty much, that's what happened. Oh, that's so good. Th this run overall was so fast. This was like 128 pace. Now, not so much. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. So there's two more still in Forest Naval. Can I collect the Chronos Reactor or not? A radar would be nice, you know? But we'll see. So now I know, don't push parts because they might clip into the void. Got it. Yeah, I mean ship parts. Same thing. Collectible. Um, MacGuffin. I think it should be back. I've definitely had Libra into the Abyss before where I just go to Sunset and it comes back though. So, it should be okay. I'm actually considering that it might just be back here. 
and I'll be happy. Hey! Okay. No! No! The Abyss has some crazy weird physics, man. Okay, let's hope that the other thing is back too. Yeah, I repeat that shit, exactly that's what I'm saying. Runs living. Runs alive. We're living. Or are we? Because it really depends on what's here. Because I'm fairly sure this was the last piece that I needed. And I don't know what happened to it. I really thought that this was the last thing. Did I actually collect this or not? Does anyone actually know? For a fact. I didn't get this. But it's not here. So what else is missing? It's this. It must be this guy. I'm genuinely just missing it. Yeah, I didn't get this. So what the hell? Like, there's nothing here. Unless it was a snitch bug again. And it's flown off, like, off the map or something. But I can't tell because I don't have radar. Oh, I thought that was something weird. Ah, what do I do? Just come back later. Practice, practice distance spring. Yeah, I'm being totally gaslit right now. I thought I'd collected, not collected this. I thought I had not collected. That. What if it was the smoky prog this whole time? It was the smoky prog, and it went up to the gate for some reason. Oh, that's so stupid! I lost so much time because of my own idiocy. Not checking this. I should have checked here. I just didn't think that the smoky prog would go up from the freaking puff stool arena and go here. But now I know. Now I know. Next time, I won't make the same mistake. I should have just dealt with the Smoky Prog on day one. That's Forest Naval, I mean. Maybe I should have just done it then, huh? All that for a fucking gear. And incredibly, I'm going to still be ahead. But we'll see what happens in Distant Spring anyway. that red in particular. So in this scenario I actually mixed up which um, which boss I thought I had fought. So, that's funny. Still ahead. But goddamn, I could have been like six minutes ahead. If Cronus Reactor wasn't pushed into the void. <laughs> which is funny to say. And uh, if Smoky Prog if I'd checked, and if I'd known that Smoky Prog doesn't go up there. But now I know that he does. So, there you go. Progs can get past some walls, and it's a matter of knowledge for which walls it can or not get past. 
Run's living. I'm ahead. God, this could have been so fucking fast. Oh my god. That's absolutely mental. The amount of time lost. Jesus. But I'm going to stop going off about it. Uh, the point is that I have learned some very, very, very valuable lessons. And radar at impact site is a blessed seed, yes. It is absolutely blessed. We need that next time, huh? Okay, give me 90 blues. Thank you for the 90 blues. Secret safer impact site, yeah, that's cursed. But I've had glue on drive in impact site before. Okay, nothing to fight. That's good. Hey, there's radar. Where were you when I needed you? God damn. And a bread bug where the prog should be. Classic. And a Wallywog fight too. This is probably going to be ADF or something. Just you watch. Come on, buddy. You can do it. I had radar last time, Divine. I had radar in, in Final Trial last time. Wallywog there, and a bulb orb. I'm going to lure both of them this way. I've made a friend. Hey, I'm a matchmaker. Let's go. There's a snagger here, I think. Ah! No, it was a snitch bug. Stop that, it's not helping. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, that's a lot of nectar. No! Ah, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, I'm going for an average of 30 for everything. There are four treasures heavier than... Um... Are there four heavier than 30? I think so. I think that's how it works. I don't have time for what I've gotten already. All I have time for is what's expected. In my stupid head. I can't keep track of what I've gotten. I can't even keep track of Gulix. even keep track of, sorry, what I had thought or not sort of thing. But it turns out that I actually could keep track of it. I knew I hadn't killed that thing, but actually it was a smoky prog and it was somewhere else, so whatever. Yeah. Moving on.
Didn't need to bring my blues back here. Anyway. That's why there's so many bread bugs. Jesus Christ. Welcome to the bread bug seed. That's a lovely bit of water. Very nice game. Thank you for showing me that leg of water. Very pretty. Alright, am I going to be able to clip up? Eh, maybe. If I use the Mamata. I could use the Mamata. I could also use the Bulbul. Done more damage to it from behind. Oh my god. It's me, Mamuda. No. Oh no. New knowledge is acquired. In a bad way. Apparently you can't can't clip with the ball bulbs, they're too not dense. Get me up there, bro. Okay, I'm gonna do this. To push myself like physically into the wall. Oh no! Bad new knowledge acquired. They're not thick enough, yeah. Pretty much. Well, I'll stop trying. That sucks. Surely Mamuta, Mamuta is thick enough to push me up. Oh no, he's too thick. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> that was pretty slow. Right, what's up here then? Uh, bolt. Beep boop. I am human. Hey, just thick enough. Oh, EFD. That kind of sucks. A little bit. Ooh, also, bolt is a very wobbly part. It's one of those wobblers. You can get it onto dry land and then um, get EFD instead. So I'll come back for EFD. Uh, I need to get my yellows. Fucking ice climbers.
Icy's man who needs him. Yep. I threw too many over. Soon to die. Oh, the double um, Libra Sagittarius combo again. Kind of funny. To remember that ACB is still an enemy and is not dead. No, Smoky Prog is a good genre. Very flavorful prog. Also, I just realized I'm one short of a miracle. If only I had more blues. But no, I, I wouldn't do it anyway. I have to kill this ACB. Oh, I know what happened. The bridge pickmen are dying because of another um, buried enemy. Yep, it's my fault. Uh, I forgot what was up high. Um. My bad. I have to find out. Oh yeah, pilot seat. I knew that. And then I forgot. Oh no, you cock. He's undoing all my work. Killed all my Pikmin now, he's ruining my life. Find out what happens next episode. On Mori. Actually, the worst enemy ever. Ah, uh, fine, you die. Alright, I've got to get this down. Okay, 10 minutes to finish Distant Spring. Eee. We'll see.
damn it, this could have been such a fucking good run even with this distance being so far. But no. I screwed it. I done fucked it. That's what I did. And it's hard to unfuck something that's fucked. Everyone loses. Brutal. That is just brutal, isn't it? Okay. Here we go. Five more parts. Um, pilot seat. ACB arena. The two that are in the water. And uh, the one that's where Zikaimura is. I left so many behind because they were on the bridge. Faster than saving them, yeah, exactly. What am I supposed to do? Save them? Ugh. That's annoying. Shouts to the vanilla blowhog, sort of. Please. Please. You bastard. Nah, I actually don't care that much. failed the one cycle though. Alright, what is it this time? Mamata, hello. Ooh, I got the bridge glitch. That's actually really rare. So there's uh, a glitch that happens here when a bridge is being undone slightly. Like, look, it's, it's weirdly undone. Look at that. It's just a pile of sticks, but it's making me laugh. Anyway. Thank God for plug phone. Can't do maths. It's, six, it's 46, not 56. I'll be alright. The narrator. They were not all right. Okay, I'm gonna be pretty far ahead actually after this. Because I'm nearly done. Those are the last three to move. I now have a Zirconium Rotor to push. When this comes through the gate, I'll go grab Zirconium Rotor. You know what I mean. It's not actually a cunning run, but it pretty much is. Uh, I should also get the other thing going as well. Get the bolt. Yeah, I was going for like half Morgan Freeman and half me, and I think I nailed it. 
Wait, hang on, I can max carry. What are you doing? Just max carry it. Yeah, oh, vanilla blowhog. Ah, it's terrifying. He shoots vanilla at you. Oh, you bastard! So, fun fact: snitch bugs don't actually target the things that are being carried. So that's just fine to just leave like that. No point saving that yellow, actually. But I did it anyway, because I'm nice. Too nice. I love that the bread bugs kind of just beeline to your house. Just chill there. The landing site, yeah. Shouts to the funny sex number. Couldn't have done it without you. No. No. It's fine. Just go. No, I messed up the area. Uh, I might not have made it anyway, but that's a shame. So I'm still ahead, actually. Which just goes to show you how crazy this run was. Without such an annoying mistake. We'll see, though. Um, final trial will be an issue, maybe. If this doesn't PB by over a minute... I'm just going to upload the other one, because <laughs> it went much more smoothly. Plus, I felt like I was more entertaining in the other one, too. So. I know it's no big deal. Or maybe this is funny for the... Nah. Nah, nah the other one was better. I'll upload, upload that one. This one was funnier. Well, yeah, the other one is a better run overall in terms of run quality, and people don't need to know that this one exists. Ah, gold. By point two, by the way. Damn, this was the sub one thirty. It was. Could have easily been, and then it wasn't. Hey, Kakara! Oh my god, yes! Hello! Uh, you've, you're joining at the end of my stream. Uh, but I did it. I should now uh, get a personal best. God, that's actually the worst luck. No. You just said good luck and I got the worst possible luck. Oh no. I think that alone has just cost me the world record. Or maybe I threw on purpose. You'll never know.
か <laughs> oh okay cool well, thanks for watching it's been going well well sort of well kind of well it's been going okay Well, if it's world record, it's world record and it gets uploaded. That's the thing, I could have pushed the box, but it would have never gone toward- no, it's the, it's the spring. When did I get ADF? I don't remember getting ADF. Uh, I must have got it. Staggered. Really? Oh yeah, Mamita. Jesus, my memory is like, awful. Anyway, there we go. Beautiful. Game over. And I'm going to be minus 20 seconds, so this dumpster fire of a run goes on YouTube. The Snagret that was BLR. Yes. I remember. Hooray! Uh, maybe I could just upload this whole stream so people could just watch whichever one they prefer. Oh, yeah. Let's go. What a crazy run, oh my god, I could have been... This could have been the sub-130. Easily. And I, uh... Unfortunately lost it because of two things which I have now learnt a lesson. Like, I didn't think there would be lessons to be learnt, but I did, I, I learnt a lesson. Lesson one was that, um... Don't let things get pushed when you're near the abyss, because they will fall into the abyss, and that will screw your, up, uh, screw your run up. And the second thing I learnt was that Smoky Progs, when they spawn in the Puffstool Arena, we'll go up to the BLL Gate Arena. Arena Gate. They'll go up there and they'll, they'll deja vu, they'll initial D, they'll animate everything up, uh, and then um, you'll think that they were something else. So you can probably tell which boss the Smoky Prog is by how they do, like, multi-track drifting and stuff. You can figure that out. But overall, yes, let's go! Sick run. I'm happy with how I played some parts of it, and there are other parts which I am sure I can improve on. So, um, stay tuned next time. Hopefully I'll sub 140. I don't know. No, no, no. 130. I mean, I subbed 140 today for the first time. I've improved my PB by 6 minutes. Now, next time I come, hopefully it will be a sub 130. Um, so yeah, this will go up on YouTube. 